Okay, today we're going to demonstrate ankle block using a nerve stimulation. Uh, we're going to first block the posterior tibia, uh, which lies behind the posterior tibial artery, or midpoint between the medial malleolus and the achilles tendon. Okay, so we're going to... Okay. And as soon as we actually go near the nerve, we should actually see the twitches on the foot. Okay, you can actually see see the twitching of the foot. That is from the your posterior tibia which divided into medial and the little branches. It can reduce the cone effect. Okay, you can still see the twitching at 0 0.5, 0 0.4, and it's gone at 0 0.3. Increase it to 0 0.4, it's come back. And so we inject around 5 to 7 mLs at that point. The next nerve we're going to block is the deep peroneal, which is almost just a finger breadth from the uh, tibial tuberosity. Again, we need to increase the current to 5. Okay, there you go. You can see. See the twitching there, okay. And another few elements there. Next is the superficial peroneal nerve, which I'm going to block it sort of at the mid half level. Okay, that's the twitch again. And again, just few mLs. And that's gone. Saphenous is more cutaneous here, so we're just going to do an injection between the two malleoli. Starting from the midpoint, okay, and a cutaneous injection. Okay, you just read a blood. And if you inject it on the other side, that is literally, that blocks the superficial uh, branches of the peroneal as well. We are not blocking this uh, pseudo nerve here which is normally blocked between the little malleoli and the echolus tendon just subcutaneous injection on the little side and you can block a few MS there.